105.9 FM. Your feel good radio. Oh yeah, so my people, on a good morning uh, and welcome to Newspaper Tori on Top Fresh 105.9 FM with the regional from the city of Ibado. My name na Vincent Omomine Eda. As a jabale they come out, na so me they take my seat. And with me for here, I get a Vanguard newspaper, the Daily Sun, the Punch newspaper, the three of them, they my face for here. Uh, when I don't hear most of the story them for uh, freshly pressed, when I still hear them for a jab ballet, me, I go just uh, bring um, short, short, uh, all for your listening pleasure. Oh, yeah, make you follow me, make you go together. My first story this morning, it come from the Punch newspaper for Inside Page 7 of the Punch newspaper, where the headline for there for say, protest storms National Assembly with protesters, storms National Assembly with mat generators and demand Saraki's resignation. Yes, many civil society organizations, we them join hand together under one group where them call Citizens United for Peace and Stability, Nice show face for National Assembly yesterday as them block everywhere, carry their generator plus include their mat follow body with different signs where they carry as placard. Some of them where they talk say occupy National Assembly. Others say hashtag reclaim Nigeria as they ask for the resignation of the Senate President Bukola Saraki. For more on top of that story, make gonna check the page seven of the Punch newspaper will come out this morning. Still on top Punch newspaper, this one it they come from Enugu State as uh, the people of the Ukpabi Nimbo community for Uzo Wani local government of Enugu State, where the Fulani headsmen for kill many people on Monday, they don't come out. They blame the security agencies of the area. As an talk say, they use play, play I, they look the information where we say he reach their hand before the attack. Now, when the state governor, Ifanyi Uguanyi, visit the community yesterday, then they come out talk, say, the security agencies for the area, they say them abandon them, uh, make the Fulani people use them to do uh, action film. We're going to check more on top of that story for the page two of the Punch newspaper. <music> Oh yes, now still newspaper to read the regional from the heart of the Badon on Fresh 105.9 FM. Still on top punch newspaper, another to read there where uh, federal government for the promise of said they go fix Lagos Ibadan Expressway. The story say the money for the repair of the Lagos Ibadan Expressway. Where they inside, don't they inside the 2016 budget and then go make sure, say, them do the road, even though, say, one court injunction, they on top the road matter. The federal government of Niger say the development of the country plus include the lives of citizens, no be waiting with it carry put for corner because of one court case. Now, the Minister of Power, Works and Housing, Babatunde Fashola, now yan this talk yesterday for Abuja, as the yan say government, it go pay more attention to the development of road with the carry heavy, heavy truck plus include moto. <music> On top, 
Vanguard newspaper and I'm for see this story as they talk say Nigeria go well if them arrest Jonathan. The Nota branch of the Christian Association of Nigeria can. It don't come out. They advise President Muhammadu Buhari against the arrest of former President Goodluck Jonathan. As them tell talk am, them say Nigeria go boil koto koto like ukodo where then use on rye plantain cook. If them arrest, if some people try arrest the former president, will be President Goodluck Jonathan, where some people they see as the hero of democracy. Then talk say make government focus their attention on the Fulani Katurieras, where they kill people anyhow for the country now. The story say Niger go boil like hot soap if them arrest Jonathan. You go see that story for Vanguard newspaper will come out this morning. On top, the Sun newspaper, the Daily Sun. Name me for see this one. As uh, we hear that say Fulani headsmen don't start again, no. I say they don't begin them again. As we hear say they do some kind uh, things for Delta State yesterday. The Tory say some Fulani headsmen then kidnap eight people for Obiaruku, where they for Ukwani local government area of Delta State yesterday. They can't keep them for their cabal for some hours. Now, as the farmers, they work for their farm early momo around 6 a.m., now the guys show face, grab the farmers, come hold them for grand, say, now them, now kill four of their cow, where they say he died. But later, the youth leader of the community, comrade Chika Uwabuofu, he can confirm and say, they don't release the farmers around 2.30 p.m. after tension don't full grand. For the community. That story day for the Sun newspaper. You can also see them for inside the Vanguard newspaper for page 13. We come out this morning. Another story day for my hand here. Yeah. Uh, a day for the Vanguard newspaper. You go see them for page 7. Of a Vanguard newspaper, as with a year and say they don't shut down the University of Ibadan. We are say they don't shut down the University of Ibadan, will be UI, till further notice because of the two day protest where the students them do. The tourists say the students them do this protest because of the suspension of one of their union leader, plus include other things. With them need for the school, we in no day. The student then complain about light plus include water, we no day, and it they make life difficult plus including say the thing, it they make learning difficult for them. For more on top of that, to remake you check page seven of the Vanguard newspaper as them talk and say they don't shut down UI because of the two day protest where the students them do. Yes, my people, now here now me, I go carry my paper waka on top newspaper to read this morning. When I don't hear them, plenty, plenty from uh, freshly pressed, rich Aja Bale, can rich newspaper to read. What you remain now, now for you to go grab your paper, make you enjoy the to read them very well. My name is Vincent or Momine Eda. We go bring you more pigeon to read at 3 o'clock for Fresh 105.9 FM. Una good morning. <music>